one that created you and sees destiny all inside of you. Don't you understand there's nothing you do that surprises God? Yeah, I know that's right. But he said, look past all of that and focus on me. Where does my help come from? The one who created the heavens hmm. and the earth. Yes, Lord. Expand your focus. You serve a great big God. Yes, you do. Yes, we do. <laughs> He's bigger than your circumstance and your situation. Yes, he is. I like to tell people this all the time. Your destiny is bigger than where you're at right now. Yes. Yes, sir. Ah, I know that's right. Somebody ain't Hallelujah. I know that's right. Your destiny is bigger than where you are right now. Yes. Hallelujah. It's bigger than the job you have right now. I know that's right. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, it is. You're happy with what you have, and God says that's nothing. Ah, my God, come on. That ain't nothing. That's not with somebody. That is nothing. You think you have arrived. Come on, pastor. God said, you ain't even got started yet. Woo, come on. I know the thoughts that I have for you. Oh, you. I know the plans that I have for you. Woo. My God. Prosper. Said, I, I know I know. Respect it in. Look past the hills. Yes, Lord. Woo. To the one that created the heavens and the earth. Yes, yes, sir. Look past your circumstance right now. To the God of your circumstance. Yes. Yeah. They said, if we're going to make it, we got to look past the obstacle and see the one who can allow us to overcome. Lord. Come on. Come on, come on. Yeah. Look at your neighbor and said, it might not look like it right now. It might not look like it right now. But I am an overcomer. But I am overcomer. Woo! Got to preach right I now. I might be down right now, but I'm getting ready to get back up. It might not look good right now, but I'm getting ready to get back up. I might be down for the eight count, but I'm going to get back up. It's not over till God says it's over. Be careful how you treat me while I'm down, because when God lifts me up, can't nobody bring me down. Be careful how you talk to me right now, because when God puts his hand on me, your name father oh my God. and what happened was after they got there 
See, the first part was, Lord, we just want to keep our focus on you so we can get to the destiny. But once they got there, they were able to look back and realize, you kept me. My God. Uh, woo. My God. Uh, listen to that. What happened, pastors, when they got there, they realized it wasn't us. Yeah. Uh, my God. You all the time. My God. I got me Holy Ghost. See, when you got to realize it's not you, you didn't do anything. Because if God would have left it up to you, you'd have messed it up. When they walked in the synagogue, in the temple, they just looked back and said, God, you kept us. Help me, Holy Ghost. Every now and then, you got to look back over your life and just say, God, you kept me. I, I should have lost my mind, but you kept me. I, I should have went crazy. Shoot up than anybody, but you ain't got no disease. God has kept 